Q&A time. Just to get it out of the way because the most commonly asked questions in every single Q&A, are you ready for your fourth child? or do you want a son? <laughs> We've answered that thousands of times, so I'm not even gonna get into that. This is from Anna, and she asked, how do you guys budget? Do you have one account, or do you each have your own account? I'd love to hear how you guys navigate financial planning. I think right when we got engaged, uh -huh. we started a joint account. Mm -hmm. But the financial oh, he is all me. He does all the financial stuff. I do not keep track of bills or anything, <laughs> which I love. And actually, a lot of our bills are... Almost everything is automated. So I we, just think that's a, a good thing to do because you don't want to chance being late for a payment. One time we actually didn't pay our utilities that they turned oh, yeah, off yeah. our water. Yeah. It was because our card was expired yeah. and we didn't put in the new card. So I remember it was when I was like washing the dishes. I'm like, honey, what's going on with our bad. water? I was so PO. Trisha asked, are you ever going to come to Australia? Yeah, in fact, I thought we were going to go this year but plans fell through. There were so many other events that we had to attend. The um, difficulty is it's literally one of the farthest places from Seattle, Washington. From here though, it's like 20, 24 hours away. Australia is one of the countries. Australia and Thailand are my top two countries that I really want to visit that we've never been to. Jessica No asks, how do you guys resolve conflict when you disagree on something? Do you negotiate and compromise? First off, we separate from each other because <laughs> Judy would want to rip my head off and I just get angry. Yeah. Uh, Before, and I'm very vocal. That's yeah. one thing about me. I'm very vocal. He's like so vocal. I actually come from a family where we're not vocal about things. Yeah. And I think that like actually hurts the relationship or like builds more tension. So I'm like on it. But if it gets too heated, then I know that we both need, we need our time. time apart. I find that I'm very irrational um, in the heat of the moment and I, I'll say things that I'll regret and uh, I just need my space. Like I cannot stand conflict. Like, I feel like I, I'm about to explode. We're both rational as long as we have that separation for a little bit. When yeah. we come oh, back together gosh, and like we're less heated, we're like, we, usually one of us will apologize or yeah. neither one will apologize because we were both wrong. There's been a time before where we were both heated in the moment and it was like full on screams. That rarely happens, but that was ugly. I mean, it never got physical where we got physical with each other, but um, we don't want to get to that point. So ever since then, we learned to just kind of like part breathe. and breathe what and we tell the girls. things out. And sometimes it even takes like a full day. It won't take more than a day. Sometimes what we really need is just to have sex. Or even sex or sleep. Yeah. Aaron asked, what are three words that you would use to describe each other? Beautiful, kind, third word, generous. Oh, nice. We actually asked this of each other two other days day. ago. Yeah. Um, I was telling Benji, you're hardworking, uh -huh. determined, uh -huh. and... You said ambitious. Oh, and oh yeah. Ambitious, ambitious and hardworking and thoughtful. Mm. You're super thoughtful. <laughs> I have a lot of thoughts. <laughs> thoughtful slash caring towards me especially. I definitely care about you. Yeah, you too. You're so sweet. I love her. I do. A lot. I love you. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot what that video was, but they made you stand in front of a loved one and just oh, look into yeah. each other's eyes. Don't even say anything. And like everybody started crying and I'm like, I started crying watching it. Mm -hmm. And like, that's what happened. I was trying to make you cry, but I cried. <laughs> Jam Kayanan asks, when is the puppy coming? When the house is built and we're settled in. I feel like- And we have, have a fence. You already chosen a breed, which I think that breed is super cute. It kind of look. what's it called again? Why don't you guess in the comments uh, area? It looks like a mix of a Rottweiler uh -huh. and a Beagle. My thing with a dog, which really saddens me, is that Juliana is allergic to 
animal or mm -hmm. pets. But I mean, we'll have to test it out. Maybe we'll have to like babysit that breed of dog and then see how it works with Juliana because she breaks out knives and- Mia, she wants a cat. Yeah, Mia expressed but a few she times. she wants a cat for each sister. <laughs> <laughs> this is a funny question. By the way, if you like this Q&A stuff, give it a thumbs up, let us know. This is from Christina. She asked, have you guys ever been caught or interrupted by the kids while having sexy time? Well, uh, what parent hasn't, seriously? But we haven't. Yeah, we have. No, we haven't. Uh, yes. Oh, I mean, not like- Like, literally the other night. But not caught. Not caught. Like, oh, yeah, they yeah, heard yeah. they would knock on our door and we're like, and we're like oh, scrambling we're like underneath. Ninjas. But we've never been caught. Oh my gosh, knock on wood. That would be the most <laughs> horrific day of my life. That's why sometimes I just want to be under the blanket anyway. Mm. Oh my god, I cannot imagine. Like that's... <laughs> okay, Charlotte asks, besides family and marriage, what's your most proud moment to date and why? Dance embers. Oh, dance embers. The different dance embers and having so many of you guys support us and give so generously to help a lot of people. That's definitely a highlight of my life. That's Outside true. of family stuff, when totally. obviously stuff with us. Getting my college degree, mm. uh, it was a really proud moment in my life. Emil asks, what was JB Kira's and Mia's most, almost name? Okay, this is funny. I don't know if we ever mentioned this in the vlog, but I actually had an index card of names. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I asked Benji, <laughs> choose two names. <laughs> okay, yeah. Right? Okay. I wish I had that index card because I don't remember what the Well, other I can name. tell you this. One of the names was going to be Leona. Oh, yeah, it was. But that's a whole nother story. <laughs> Leona. <laughs> Juliana's name was originally Juliet. And oh, yeah. like we chose Juliet together and then closer to the due date, I, I said, I don't feel it. I don't feel like she's a Juliet. And then um, a like a couple days before I'm like, it's Juliana. Jan Nicole asks, have you guys ever thought about releasing a book? I think Benji had previously may have talked about a book for video influencers, whether it's how to run a family vlog, biography or cookbook, or even children's book, like the Saponi Jolie. Benji. Well, I definitely have a book coming out called, uh, actually it's a secret title right now. But uh, it should be coming out in two months. I'm curious because I would love to write a book with you one yeah. day, but what topic would you guys be most interested in? I'm curious about what you guys yeah. would think would be the most valuable for you guys coming from us. Mayra asks, what is one thing that you like about each other and one thing that you dislike? One thing I like about you, if I had to only pick one thing, your... Why you look scared? <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to make sure I pick the good one thing. That's like, there's so many things I like about okay. you. I like that you cook dishes that I like. I cook like three dishes. Well, yeah, those three <laughs> dishes. <laughs> Curry. I would already know the food that you don't like, so I don't bother. Yeah, so anyways, I appreciate that. And one thing that I dislike about you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mm -hmm. What is that? One thing I dislike what about you. Oh, that? you're curious. He's curious. Uh, one thing I, I'm just, I'm like really trying to dig here. Actually, I don't, I can't you're trying think to of dig it. for the safe um, answer. No, not the safe one. Okay. Um, one thing I dislike <laughs> is how Judy pinches me with her toes sometimes. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, mm -hmm. you don't really like do that dislike all. that. And that's a fact. I do pinch him with my toes. Because it hurts. Like, <laughs> Like, like how can somebody pinch someone with their toes and hurts? Yeah. Okay, now your turn. You have to. You know, trait. Um. Okay. So one thing I like about you mm -hmm. is. Oh my gosh! Can it be? This is like what I like and I don't like about you. Okay. okay here's the answer. How you're most of the time right. Most of the time <laughs> right. Okay. I like it and I don't like it. Oh, that's a very safe answer. And it's I so true, it. no. but is it true? <laughs> yeah. Like, sometimes I get so pissed because he's right and I don't want to admit it. Mm. Okay, one more. Can I pick one? Okay. 
cool. At Nick013 asks, what's your guys' best marriage advice? I already know. I mean, okay, so we've been, okay, you want to start? No, you go. It's not like we've been married forever. We got married in 2011, mm -hmm. so seven years. My best marriage advice, and I think we've, we've talked about this before, is to make time for each other mm. and to prioritize yep. it. Totally. Date nights. Don't discount the small little deeds and small gifts throughout the day. Oh, that's so true. Like, to me, Valentine's Day is such a flop for me because <laughs> I feel like you're given that one day in a year to be thoughtful and to give gifts and express your love when I feel like that should be every single day. I mean, obviously you'll have your, your down days, but it should not just be one day. It should be every day year long so like the small That's little so things that you might just think that get overlooked well they all add oh, up they do add up and i count them you count them yeah oh, okay. i know them every time you ask to make me coffee or you know you cook for us mm. like that's really nice mm. those are those are coins going into my love bank <laughs> So, no, but do you literally count them? Like, do you have it no, like no, a no, I don't. notebook? No, oh. I don't. Anyway, that's it for our Q&A. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And please thumbs up if you had fun watching this, crying or laughing with us. But anyway, thank you guys so much. Peace. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.